this program is really the outgrowth of, of Peabody's commitment to deeply understanding and engaging with independent school leaders. And the local independent school community have assisted us in the creation of this program. I think there's a couple of things uh, that makes us incredibly unique. One is the quality of our faculty. What is the role of education in a democracy? Really wrestling with some of the key big questions, like what are the roles of schools in society today? What should schools of the future look like? What does it really mean um, to take on a role of an educational leadership in the future? I really think there are five innovative elements of the new Masters in Independent School Leadership program here at Peabody College. The first is that it's cohort-based. Exactly. It's a standalone, uh, not uh, yeah, exactly. And by having a cohort-based program, you over time really develop a community, which mirrors very much the independent school context. The second aspect of our program is that it's summer intensive. And what this enables us to do is to draw a cohort from across the country. So the residency program, or the time here in the summer, really allows um, almost like a buffered private time to engage in the cognitive intellectual work of learning. The third aspect is that it incorporates uh, a school year within two summers. The benefit of the academic work um, during the school year is that the student will then be able to apply and engage with the work of practice um, with support from both other students, their colleagues, but also with support from the professors. The fourth innovative aspect of our program is that in addition to the world-class faculty at Peabody and, and the broader Vanderbilt community, uh, we will also rely on a, a small group of purposely chosen expert independent school practitioners. If you're here studying at Peabody, you're going to have, have at arm's length a pretty inclusive range of other types of schools um, and opportunities for case study and collegial interaction. What's been good for a week at a time in the summer is going to be exponentially uh, more powerful to do it as a degree program. And the fifth innovative element is the program is, is really um, busting apart the traditional uh, three and four credit hour course model, creating very targeted specific modules of content. There will be practical application of that content in your school site where you get to dig in and engage with a full uh, constituent base at your school to really implement what you're learning. So this is something you can do with your own data. So we believe that this model actually is um, much more conducive to adult learning and much more conducive to really helping uh, aspiring leaders begin to implement what they're learning um, in real schools in real time. Since this is a program for aspiring leaders, we would want to see evidence that a teacher, for example, has taken on leadership roles in their schools. Those can be formal, but they certainly can be informal roles, heading up committees, um, implementing an innovation in the school, working with students in a leadership capacity, being a division head, things of that nature. Um, the second thing we're really going to look for is someone who's passionate and um, is passionate about the work of schooling and really articulate about why Peabody and why they are making this investment in their education at this point in time in their career. So what we need specifically to find those things out are um, the GRE, then we also need your transcripts from all your previous academic work and um, you know a GPA of 3.0 3 somewhere in that range and then we want to see um, letters of recommendation and typically for this program they could be from academic uh, faculty members who've had you in class or they could be your uh, supervisors. The other things that we need 
are um, is a statement of purpose. That statement of purpose is what is going to tell us if this program really is going to be able to suit your goals and your needs. Uh, so just talk about kind of what you've been doing, what you're interested in, uh, what you want to do with this. I will be your first point of contact for any information you need about this program. I am in the office pretty much 8 to 5, Monday through Friday. So just give me a call, drop me an email.